a loud music's a little much, right? When like cars are driving by, like, do I need to hear what you're playing? You know, do I need to hear what you're listening to in your car? Um, I think I have an eating disorder. I know that I really shouldn't look to the internet as confirmation, but um, what's going on? Um, it's been going on about uh, a week now. Two weeks? Yes, two weeks now. Um, I don't have much of an appetite, which is new-ish. Um, I always eat like a bird. Regardless, I'll get like a bunch of food and I'll take like a couple of bites and then like I'll maybe like eat the rest of it at midnight. But um, having a lot of stomach pains. Um, if I do eat, I do end up vomiting. Um, or going number two. Sorry, that's TMI. Um, the smell of food uh, makes me nauseous. Um, I can't even drink like I used to, which if you know me, I'm, I'm a very, very heavy drinker. But like, just the little thing on my stomach makes me feel full and, and then I throw up. Um, tired cold a lot um so yeah i'm sleeping i'm definitely sleeping um, i'm still going to the gym but like i don't have the the energy which obviously like it's because i have no energy because i'm not consuming food um this isn't funny it's actually quite scary um i am like i said i am making myself eat but it hurts um How many more times do I need to complain that I hate being at home? But it's, it's not only like my mom's obsessive composer, I forgot to tell her not to touch my stuff today. And I literally have to tell her every day, don't touch my stuff. And I forgot to tell her, which means that I'll come home to something being thrown away or misplaced. And I think someone's using my soap, which is so disgusting. Like, you don't have your own soap? Literally, my mom has a cabinet full of soaps. You know, that's how obsessive compulsive she is. Why are you touching mine? That's gross. So I threw away my soap today. Um, who knows what else they're fucking using or they're fucking touching. Um, now on top of my sister bullying me, my brother's talking shit to me as well, which I'm like, okay, you're setting the great example for your fucking kids. God. I just feel like I have no control over anything at all in my life I have no control over my my own belongings you know like they obviously belong to someone else <laughs> my phone's not even mine I'm on my family's fucking phone plan on which I'm like can I not be on it anymore but it's convenient for everyone so I try not to I try not to bother anyone I try not to complain I try not to say shit I have no control of my fucking work environment. It's like every job sucks. They all, they're all shitty, so what's the point in working? What's the point of doing an honest job? I might as well lie like everyone else then. I have no energy. I don't want to do anything. Nothing motivates me because nothing's getting better. Everything is literally getting worse now. I literally can't even eat now, which is okay, I guess, because I don't have any money anyway, so saving money on food and alcohol because I can't keep anything down. I'm also not making any money anyway, so <laughs> what's the point? This is going to sound really bad, but you know what one of the worst parts is? Other than that Carla segment the guy I used to talk to or whatever mess around with the guy I used to mess around with the worst part is I feel like I still look fat that's it